Hey guys, this is Dabson Ishmael. In today's tutorial, we are going to take a look at how to use the robot text in version 17 of WYSIWYG Web Builder. So there are two ways to locate or make changes to the robot text. One way is simply right clicking on an empty space on your canvas and then going to page properties. And then when you come here, you head over to the SEO section. And then at the very top under search engine optimization, you have the robot text and the options that exist uh, beneath it. The other option is simply coming to tools and then click on a robot text. And this is going to give you the robot text section of the entire website and how to configure and go about that. The cool aspect of this particular feature is that it allows you to be able to just do um, one rule, which is going to apply to all pages. That is, if you want it that way, or if you want to um, apply rules to specific pages, it's easier to select those pages and then apply those rules to them, as well as asset files or folders, be it images, CSS, JavaScript, and so on over here. So the first thing you'd want to do is to first generate a robot text, which is going to be applied to the website. And then after generating the robot text, you have the general rule, which applies to the all the pages. So you can select allow all, this allow all, or you can select specific pages by simply selecting the page over here. And then you come to the rule and whatever rule you want to set to them, you're able to do that from here. And then also for images. So if you want to be able to allow your images to be called and the rest, you simply set those rules over here. So this is how to go about using the robot text tool, which makes it easier instead of just going page by page. You can simply come to um, one central location and then make all those necessary changes using the robot um, text tool in version 17 and WYSIWYG Web Builder. So that will be just about it for this tutorial. Thank you very much for watching. Bye for now.